my friend came over last Friday and we were so bored. We were like, so what do you want to do? I don't know. What do you want to do? I don't know. <gasps> Maybe we can tie dye t-shirts. We were using this tulip one-step fashion dye. It's so cool. It, it's not even cool. It's like it's like fantastic. And it's so easy. And the great thing is, is that you can get it anywhere at your local craft store or maybe supermarket. Uh, gosh, you just I, I love you. Today I'll be showing you how to make a basic tie-dye t-shirt with the help of my friend Jocelyn. Now don't worry, I'll show you all the steps on how to do it. Disclaimer, I've never done this before, neither has Jocelyn. So. <laughs> oh man, I left. Well, you want to make sure you have a clean working area. So I suggest if you have a counter, use some garbage bags. I would recommend um, wearing another shirt because this could get really messy. All right, so here's what you're going to need. This one step fabric tie dye. It depends on how much you should buy because if you want to do just two colors, white and red, or you know another color, then you should just buy one. And it's it says it's up to it dyes up to four shirts. So we just bought a lot, so we can have a variety of colors. When you open it, it comes with your own pair of gloves and rubber bands, and these are necessary for later on. When you get the bottle that comes with the box, it says to fill the line with water and shake until it dissolved. So this is what it's going to look like. So Jocelyn and I have our shirts that we were wearing before. Make sure they're 100% cotton. And you also want to make sure that you get these wet first. Sure, well. On. What are you doing? Um, tying the shirt up. Why? To get the tie dye effect that I would like. To get the basic tie dye effect, which is what you want. <laughs> I already put a rubber band okay. in the center, and now I'm just gonna pinch it and twist. Just twist the shirt. Once I've done that, I'm going to put my gloves on. Do, 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 put my gloves on. In a circled motion, take the bottle and swirl it in and out, or vice versa. Don't be afraid to mix the colors. Be wild with it. Get crazy. See what Jocelyn's doing. Um, what am I doing? I am applying dye to my shirt. This is called sunburst. It's one of the many cool methods you could do to tie dye your shirt. Read the directions to find out more. I see you're using gloves. You safety, safety person. I think my stuff is pretty much done. What do you think? It's done. What about yours? Mine's pretty much done too. Okay, so now you want to get plastic bags, freezer bags, big bags, and we're going to open them up and just put them in there. And we're just going to place it in the sink here. This is going to take about uh, six to eight hours, but we're not going to wait that long, right? Right. 
we're gonna wait about mm, three hours, right? Okay, but in the meantime... or four hours or five hours, you take the rubber bands off of the shirt and then put it in the washer, washer, on the rinse cycle. And then after that, just put it in the good old dryer. And after. Well, thanks for watching. Um, keep tuning in to mindthemoment.com.